हेलो गाइस सो टुडे वी हैव दिस 223 सीसी क्रिस्मा जेडएमआर मोटरसाइकिल इट्स अ फ्यूल इंजेक्टेड ईसीयू कंट्रोल्ड बाइक एंड द पर्पस ऑफ डूइंग टुडेस वीडियो इज आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू रीड एंड इरेज एनी माल फंक्शन कोड दैट हैज बीन स्टोर्ड इनसाइड द ईसीयू and then i'm going to show you how to reset the ecu just using this piece of wire and uh, let's just go for it for the sake of this video i have already managed to uh, uh, remove the uh, engine oil temperature sensor wire uh, you can see right there the golden colored thing you see that right here is a uh, engine oil temperature sensor and i have removed the wire so right now uh, the code has been stored inside the ecu which is beneath this tank as you can see uh right there yep so as soon as i'm going to turn the bike on the check engine light is going to go on and it's going to blink seven times that uh, you know indicates uh, the engine oil temperature sensor malfunction so here we go you'll see uh 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 15 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 30 31 32 33 34 35 36 37 38 39 40 41 42 43 44 45 46 47 48 49
the process is pretty much similar to resetting the ECU uh, just like we did before uh, you're going to uh, short circuit this uh, green and the blue wire just like we did before and the only thing extra you want to do is uh, you're going to take out the uh, engine oil temperature sensor and uh, you're going to short circuit its port using a paper clip or something make sure this wire is really thin and it should go all the way back in and uh, when you're going to turn the ignition on the check engine light is gonna blink you know it's gonna give you long blinks like this so that means that uh, the data link connector and the engine oil temperature port has been uh, short circuited successfully so the uh, uh, process is pretty much similar you know uh, first we resetting in ECU we remove that wire and connected it uh, within five seconds now we are going to do the same with that wire you know just uh, leave it there you know you don't wanna mess with this now and uh, you just turn it on you just you remove it and you put it a back within 10 seconds so you know it's gonna blink faster now faster than before that means the throttle plate sensor has been uh, reset successfully so you switch it off you take out this wire, you take out the uh, jumper wire from the engine oil temperature sensor and you're going to plug that uh, engine oil temperature sensor port back into the uh, sensor. So everything is good to go. The throttle plate, sensor angle and the ECU has been reset successfully. Uh, you're gonna wanna do this every time you replace any sensor or uh, you know, uh, you take out the throttle body assembly or you know, remove the sensor unit wire or something, anything, anytime you know. Uh, you remove any sensor or any sensor wire you're gonna wanna reset the ECU and uh, the throttle plate angle sensor of course so um, this right here was a uh, pretty useful information as uh, you know I didn't I wasn't aware of this until now and uh, I thought I like sharing with you guys and uh, uh, I don't think even professional mechanics uh, know this thing and uh, uh, remember the uh, number of blinks uh, that you're gonna get is uh, it's gonna determine which uh, sensor is malfunctioning and uh, it's all mentioned in the description below so I hope you like this video uh, thanks for watching guys goodbye